Hi, and welcome to the next video in the Vlogger Tag series. I'm John Ray, and I'll be tackling Mondays uh, for the next 52 weeks, well, 51 weeks after today. Um, the concept behind Vlogger Tag is simple. Uh, seven days a week, we have seven different vloggers um, with no connection other than being from Pasco Hernando uh, counties and uh, being relatively new to YouTube vlogging. And uh, well, I say no connection, but uh, actually after watching Rich's intro, I see that there are some connections other than that, and we'll get to that later. Um, each episode will be a topic or discussion that could carry on from the previous episode, or it might uh, originate a new discussion thread or something, but uh, this video being my intro, uh, we'll kind of do a little bit of both. So we'll uh, see how this goes and hopefully build from there. Um, as someone who has not lived in Pasco or Hernando uh, very long, I'm interested in things to see and do in this area. So I'm out at one of the local um, botanical gardens in Hernando County. Um, this is right off Spring Hill Drive. I'm uh, on Parker Avenue, I believe, uh, next to one of the local little fire stations. Um, and that kind of raises uh, my first inquiry as to what to do in this area. So if um, the other vloggers or anybody that views this video wants to chime in with comments or with uh, advice on places to go, places to get outside, enjoy this part of Florida, um, all those thoughts are welcome. So that would be really cool. Um, there are festivals. I know we just had the Blueberry Festival last month, I believe, in uh, Brooksville. And there are other things in the area that I see advertised. But uh, myself, I've not done a lot of these things. So we'll see. Um, what we can dig up through uh, the network of people that chime in on these videos. Um, I'm an outdoors uh, enthusiast. Uh, I like to hike, bike, get out in nature, take pictures, do things like that. So um, anything we could find. One thing I did find was, uh, I believe it's called, let's see here, uh, Florida Fresh, freshfromflorida.com. Freshfromflorida.com is a website that I found that you can check in on. Um, this past month, we've had fires and uh, everything raging in some of the uh, parks and preserves in the area. You can check in on that, uh, see which parks are closed. You can um, see if there are fire bans in your area, so you shouldn't be burning and things like that. Uh, as well as, you know, your Bay News 9 and your other uh, local websites that you can uh, check in on all this information. That's uh, a great thing. But on top of just preserves and parks, there are other things that I would like to see, like um, day trips that... We all know that we can go down to Tampa and go down to uh, Bush Gardens and Venture Island, uh, Lowry Park Zoo, or go to Orlando for Disney or uh, Universal Studios. But um, some of the other things that uh, people uh, can do in the area, like uh, going up to Homosassa Springs to see the manatees, uh, all the way up to Cedar Key or the uh, Crystal River area for the Native American burial grounds or mounds or whatever. Um, those things are cool, and I hope uh, we can dig up some more uh, things like that to do, which would be really cool. Um, but so far, uh, we're out at our first park, and um, getting back to uh, my intro and how it connects to Rich's intro, he had mentioned that he likes to, uh, he rides a Harley and he's a teacher. Uh, I also like to ride. I ride a Cannondale road bike and a Trek mountain bike, um, almost the same thing, right? Tomato, tomato, or tomato lima bean in this case. Um, and I also teach uh, composition, uh, rhetoric, and um, uh, tech writing for uh, the college level. So uh, we're both teachers, I guess. So. Um, other than that, uh, I'd like to chime in and say to Rich's eight ball, we're not going to have any of that negative Nancy business. Uh, we're going to give this, uh, this our best shot and see how this goes. Um, that's my intro. I hope you enjoy viewing it. You chime in with... Um, some comments or uh, respond with your own vlog would be great. And I'll be here uh, next Monday. So until then, uh, enjoy the next seven days. I'll see you back here in a week.